And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Scattered rainfall on and off throughout the day today. We can still see some of that scattered rain right now, primarily across the far northern, far southern portions of the viewing area here in Chipkanoo County, at least remaining dry at this time. You can see a few of those heavier showers across parts of Boone and Clinton counties, a couple heavier rain showers off to the north over parts of Newton and Jasper County, Pulaski, Fulton counties as well. For the most part, we're getting a little bit of a break from that rainfall, but there is more rain on the way. And you can see this continues to spin around a low pressure system now centralized just west of Louisville, right around the Ohio River. That's not moving much, and it hasn't moved much. You can see that perfect comma shape all spinning around that one central point right there. And as this low slowly makes its way northward during the next 24 to 36 hours, we're going to see additional chances for on and off rainfall as well. On top of all of that, the Storm Prediction Center of America has placed the far eastern portions of the viewing area under a marginal risk for severe weather, though I'm not expecting much more than maybe a couple of rumbles of thunder. The reason they've done this, a stronger upper level jet uh, lingers just over the region, especially over parts of Ohio, so they've just extended that into our viewing area. I don't really think there's much more than scattered rainfall to worry about this evening, though. 68 degrees your temperature in Monticello right now, 64 New Richmond. Ladoga right at 62 degrees here in Lafayette with, with a high temperature earlier on, about 67 degrees. We're at that right now as well. Wind still breezy from the northeast, 10 miles per hour. Mainly cloudy skies, few peaks of sun. That's going to be what we deal with, at least through the evening hours as that low slowly makes its way northward. Now, if you are headed out to those Friday night football games, make sure to bring an umbrella. You're going to see some scattered rainfall, not a washout by any means. And again, I'm not expecting a whole lot of lightning and thunder out of this system, so we shouldn't see any cancellations either. Just play through that rain. Your snapshot forecast backdrop, Laura Starkey setting in the beautiful backdrop, but since it's Friday, we look at the frenzy forecast. 62 degrees, their temperature at kickoff, back down to around 57 by your fourth quarter. Winds will be from the northeast throughout the evening hours, and again, prepare for that isolated rainfall. 54 degrees, your overnight low temperature here in West Lafayette. Tomorrow does bring additional chances of rain. If you're heading out to the Feast of Hunter's Moon at Fort Weatnon, just south of town, we'll have that umbrella again. Not a washout. This is going to be this kind of the case that we deal with over the next couple of days. On and off shower chances, not necessarily heavy rain. Rain at times, but we could be dealing with these chances of rainfall at least through Sunday. After that point, things finally dry out. We do warm back up. Those Sundays should be significantly drier than what we dealt with today and as well as tomorrow. 66, your high temperature in West Lafayette for Saturday. Sunday, a high temperature back up to around 70, back up to 72, Kayla, on Monday. Tuesday and Wednesday looking even nicer. Mostly sunny skies both of those days for Tuesday and the midweek. Check out that high temperature on Wednesday, though. Fall just getting underway, but it's certainly feeling a bit more like summer as we get towards Wednesday. A high temperature of 79 degrees. All right. Well, okay. Thank you, Cameron.